the main thrust of the new law is actually to tighten up hate speech against vulnerable groups that can find themselves targeted by mobs. But one part of it says that someone can commit a crime by merely, and I'm quoting here, possessing material that's likely to incite violence or hatred. We have concerns about the section that you refer to, Adrian. Um, the section refers to the offence of uh, possessing or preparing material. If somebody is going out of their house with a bag full of placards which have clear messages which would incite hatred against a minority group and they're on their way to a protest, that's what they want to capture. Um, but I think the way that they've done it is clumsy uh, and it's it's just a bit poorly drafted. It's not a thought crime, Adrian. In, in no uncertain terms, it's not a thought crime. For starters, there must actually be production material. So therefore, it goes beyond a, a thought, if you like. So nobody's ever going to be prosecuted for what they're thinking inside their heads. You can continue to think things inside your head that are very unsavory.